Hi, this is Dr. Darren Schmidt at the Nutritional Healing Center Van Arbor. This video is about kidneys and how to turn them on like you would turn on a faucet. So there's a blood test called GFR, which stands for glomerular filtration rate. So glomerular stands for how your kidneys are functioning, like the structures of the kidneys. How well do they filter the blood, clean the blood, and turn the waste into uh, urine? So at what rate do they do that? So GFR, glomerular filtration rate. It's one test for kidneys. And um, so on a scale of uh, 0 to 65, um, you want your number to be, it depends on your race, um, whites versus blacks, it's, it's different. So like one is 65, the other was 70, I believe. But the point is, you want your number to be above the threshold. You want it to be above 65. And if it's below 65, like 50 and 40 and 30, you got to reverse that. You got to fix those kidneys so that they work well. Now, once it, you get down to 11, 10, 9, then you're talking about dialysis. So, medicine has a monopoly on this through fear because it's scary. They have no solutions for kidney failure. When, once a kidney starts to fail in medicine, it always goes down into failure. Whereas, there are supplements that can reverse GFR and make it healthy again. And I've done this maybe four or five times in the last eight years or ten years and I don't get many um, low GFR patients or low kidney functioning patients because in medicine once they find it you get they, they, they scare you and you don't end up like looking for healthy alternatives that can actually re reverse it so um, now I'm gonna go over four different supplements these are my favorites for kidneys the first one is called Cater it's from uh, systemic formulas they're based out of Utah uh, kidney diuretic KDIR and when I read through this, um, I see a bunch of herbs, snake root and uh, buckthorn bark, um, chade bougre. I don't, I'm not very familiar with these herbs, but the point is I don't have to be a master herbalist because the guy that made this, he was a master herbalist. He was the medicine man for five Native American tribes in the American Southwest. Um, he traveled the world looking for um, what, somebody who was sick and why they got better. And that was his game in life, is to figure out how to help people with these supplements. The next one is AC Carbamide. This is from Standard Process, one of my other favorite supplement companies. Um, look up Carbamide on uh, the internet to find out what this is. But I'll tell you what, Carbamide was banned as a nutritional supplement. So Standard Process put together vitamin A, whole food vitamin A and C. And he, what they said was Carbamide is not the supplement. It's just a carrier for vitamin A and C. But the truth is, this is a carbamide supplement. They just have a little bit of A and a little bit of C, but it's like, you know, mostly carbamide. So uh, carbamide, I'm just going to say this, it's a cleaner. Um, and uh, I use this for cleaning out the kidneys. And this, both of these are good for gout, by the way, because gout is a problem with the kidneys, not cleaning crystals out. And those crystals will get, will get deposited in joints when you're not active. For example, um, it'll deposit in your feet, your big toe, or I've seen gout in the elbow or in the neck or the hip. So um, when, when you clean your kidneys out, then the gout goes away too. So anyways, these are two of my favorite supplements to uh, clean out the um, kidneys and to get the GFR up. So I remember, I got to share, share with you a guy, um, being near Detroit, I had a guy come to me, he was a body designer, an engineer for Ford. He was an alcoholic and his GFR was low. And I put him on these supplements and I tried to, you know, help him with his diet. And he got his blood test back a few months, you know, like maybe five, six months later. And his GFR was back to normal. And he was so happy, he went to the bar and he got drunk. And that was the last time I saw him. So um, despite his alcohol consumption, we were actually able to uh, help his kidneys out. And he hasn't been back, this is years ago. So that's it. You know, that's how some humans are, right? <laughs> this one is uh, Buco. It comes in um, two different size bottles. It's a liquid. And this company is from um, Europe, Germany, actually. It's called Micropharma. Now, this is, Buco is one uh, leaf, but this also has juniper berry, peppermint leaf, java tea leaf, uh, rupture wart, aerial parts, meaning stems, common bean, shell, white willow bark, 
birch leaf, uva ursi leaf, and horsetail, horsetail aerial parts. This combination of plants put together was not some, you know, one guy who had a vision one day or a dream. This is hundreds or thousands of years of herbal knowledge compiled uh, through generations in Europe. So imagine, let's go back 600 years, and you were sick, you would walk to the herbalist at the apothecary, and you say, I have these symptoms, and he would put together a collection of plants, and he would wrap them up, and you would take them home and turn them into a liquid as a tea, and then drink the tea and get better. Well, he put those plants together based on knowledge of other um, people before him, other herbalists, other patients. This is, you know, minimum 600 years history of clinical, relevant um, um, experience. So um, it's a combination of these plants. They all work well together for, we know, for hundreds of years or maybe a thousand years, maybe 2,000 years. So anyways, that's Marco Pharma. They have a fantastic history of uh, clinical knowledge from a long time ago. All right, so the last one is uh, Ren of Food. It's from Standard Process. And um, I'm just going to flip this page over. Now, the number one ingredient is, in Ren of Food is dried kidney bean juice. So isn't that interesting that the kidney bean, which looks like a kidney, it's named after the kidney. It's the number one ingredient in this kidney supplement. It heals kidneys. So who would have thought that? I don't know. And then it also has kidney in it. And there's other ingredients too. I didn't write them down. But it's got kidney bean and it's got kidney in it. And that's Rena food. So um, you want to turn on the, uh, the kidneys so they function well so that they, they get drained out. And this supports the kidney cells. And um, also there's uh, supplements that detoxify the body. And um, they can detoxify the kidneys. But the kidneys can be a very delicate organ when it comes to detoxification. You want most of your um, detoxification going through your liver, through your intestines, and not your kidneys. So um, we've had people lose uh, uh, pounds and inches of water retention by fixing their kidneys. I've seen this dozens and dozens of times. So if you have like water retention in your feet, um, you know, hands, belly, you know, waist, um, that might be a kidney issue. It could be a circulatory issue. It could be heart issue. It could be other things going on too, but um, I've seen it be the kidneys. So I hope this is helpful information. If you need our, if you need our help, um, you can contact me directly. Um, we'll put that information down below in the uh, description box.